Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. The Cairns Museum has got some things I have never seen. Hello everyone. This is the Cairns Museum Cleaning Ladies reporting from the old Cairns Gallery. Now, Susie. Yes, Doris. Say hello to everyone. Hi, everyone. Hi, everyone. Now, what are you cleaning now? Well, I've been cleaning all along here. I'm not really sure what I'm cleaning, Doris. Well, I... can, can you take us through it, Susie? It looks a bit like a handbag, Doris, this one. But it's made, it's made of canvas, I think, or some material. Mm, not a handbag, Suze. Okay. Yeah, it doesn't actually have an opening. It's only got like a little... Imagine you're living out in the cane fields. Yeah. It's hot, it's sweaty, and you're working. Come on, do it with me. You're working so hard cutting the cane. What would you need from time to time? I think I'd need a drink. You need a drink water. of water. So that's your water bottle. Oh, that's cold. Okay. So that's what that little hole at the top is. And you hold the handle up like this. And... Oh, okay. But then, Doris, why is there a birdcage in here? Is that where they kept their chickens? Well, when you've had a hard day, you might need a piece of chicken or a piece of meat or something like that. And that's what you'd put in there. Meat or anything that could get spoiled by the flies. And you'd hang it up inside or outside of your cane cutter's hut. So you had something to eat when you got back from cutting cane. What else is there, Suze? Oh, so it's not a live chicken thing. Um, Afraid not. Why is it hanging from the ceiling then? So it gets the air around it and no nasty possums or anything can take it. That's a great idea. A fantastic idea. What's this, Doris? Well, what do you think it is, Susie? Oh, well, it's a glass bottle. Let me have a good look here. Oh, yes. Well, a glass bottle with a teat on the end means it was for a... Um, maybe they were feeding their animals. Right. Baby pigs. Very busy days, cane cutting days. You only had a certain amount of time to cut the cane. You didn't have time to stop and feed the children, so you set up a bottle where the little one could go. Oh, Doris! Oh, instant feeding machine for a baby. Oh, that's really, really clever. It is, and after that hard day's work, you'd be wanting one of. It's a shower. Get under it, Suze, and oh, show us what it's for. Yes. So and then fill it up, pull the thing, oh, yeah. and bingo, shower. Yes. Now I think it's time we signed off, Susie. This is from the cane cutter's hut. Doris and Susie. Bye, everyone. Signing off. <laughs>